That's why I use production. And this particular lecture, we have as one of the regular genetics, our biology, whatever I'm saying, how our globe, global is in here, if Professor Pan got up to. I remember him because uh, we are really like and uh, so basically a red wing from the other stuff from the civilized genetics, the genomics and all other concepts in that 
I think the topic of this research is very pertinent system. But uh, this will definitely help us, all the faculty members, all the government management of the research, and the other uh, Delighted to see you here. And he is there in the Nexus University of Mexico. Many of our students from the speech have gone to that. And our PDFs and so on. We have this lesson is not a particular copy of uh, science as such and maybe so the topic is research and that's the basis of the university progression and high quality students. That's the video. So uh, in this uh, like I said, the red name will try to have few more of I would like to request that take over and uh sitting some days. Thank you, sir. I would like to give a brief introduction of Professor Bhantwadar Chaudhary. The topic is research as the basis for university progression and high quality student learning. Professor Bhantwadar Chaudhary, Professor Emeritus and former Dean, College of Veterinary Medicine, Texas and University, U.S. He had his previous and PAH and MPST degrees from the College of Veterinary Sciences, Bikaner, Rajasthan, and PhD from Swedish University of Agricultural Sciences, Uppsala, Sweden. He has vast experience in academics and research and worked as a professor at Uppsala University, Sweden, and Dean College of Veterinary Medicine, SAS AMN University. He was also the vice president at UAE University, Kerala. He has published more than 300 scientific publications like science, nature, MS, genome research, mammalian genome economics, genetics, etc., with more than 12,000 international citations. Professor Chowdhury is also a pioneer scientist in genome mapping of the animal through fish and he is based in USA and chairman and member of several international funds. Now I'd like to call upon our Vice Chancellor, Sir Dr. on this team, Dr. Choudhury and Mrs. Choudhury with Dhamma Sir. Thank Call upon Dr. Dharmeshwar Das for giving a minute to Dr. Chaudhary. So the audience is yours now. Very much. Uh, I would like to begin with sincere thanks to my Chancellor and also Director uh, Das for a very kind invitation uh, to this institution. 
I'm, I'm really thrilled to come down over here. And when I heard the name Downtown University, I was thinking that this will be the middle of Guwahati somewhere. But I took a very sick uh, tour here. And I'm so impressed that this goes to nature, very close to the world. Setting is beautiful. The backdrop is uh, mountains. Uh, there is wildlife. And in the, I see so much energy in the campus. And I should actually congratulate the students who bring so much energy to this place. Of course, the faculty members do their part in the uh, Energizing the students to do things can only matter. So, my sincere thanks are given to all of you. Telling my wife that I'm here on My dad was posted in. Shillong. He was in the army. And as a kid, I visited Guwahati uh, and took the train over here from Pakistan to go by the bus to Shillong. So I, I know the place. Uh, my journey has been quite nomadic. This is how best. I introduce myself. Although by heart I'm a librarian, but essentially I'm a teacher. Fundamentally, I'm a teacher by heart. That motivates me, that drives me, uh, that energizes me, and that encourages me every day. Uh, in addition to that, the thing that is very close to my heart also is research. From student time, I've been a very curious person. And university is a part of student. And that university took place to different places as a nomadic person, dealing with uh, Budapest Hungary, where I spent a couple of years uh, moving over to Sweden, uh, doing something very different compared to what I started with. Uh, moving from there to Denmark, where I worked for quite some time, then to Texas, sometime in Australia, and then two years in Qatar, Doha. At another university, six years at uh, UAE University of Dubai. Then I thought that 42 years of journey is more than enough. And maybe it's time to do something very different and come down and even connect to people who I left almost 38, 39 years ago after working for six years. I must say that you start with a profession, you get a degree, but then you stay in that domain throughout the profession. That's what life is about. You don't stick to it, but you find that how that serves as your comment to go and do something very good. Although I'm an animal geneticist and an animal trader, but I always try to find out what different I can do to add to that profile of growth. And like uh, Vice Chancellor Tantas Das, uh, I have been also in the administration for the past 40 years. And 
The reason for being in the administration is not to have a position, but to be a facilitator. Are you able to help others grow? So that has been part of our journey. This talk focuses on the significance of research in universities and stress. And then we traveled around 60 to 65 countries during our journey. We realized that this is the backbone of the Come from maybe any part of the world, country, college, any university. If there is research, then art is because it excites you. It takes you away from bookish knowledge, something that is more practical, it's more real. And the challenges can go beyond the borders of the books. Because that's where you pick up your own journey, something, something normal, something impactful that can help with humanity as well as the environment and the surroundings. That's all what it is about research. So let's begin with this. It, uh, the past 10 to 20 years has seen a huge boom in the number of universities that have developed. I would say that I agree with revolution, revolution, this is an educational revolution that is happening. 10 to 12 years. Why should the universities have come up on the landscape? It's a huge number. Certainly, so many universities are there. On the positive side, it's great. The culture people, many students to come and education. And at the same time, it's fulfilling the need of the nation because we need to stay new. And these universities have come up with quality for serving as a gap for education versus the future skill of the workforce that we do. So they are doing a great job. On the flip side, Short and so many universities have come up. The students are truly confused. What to choose, where to go, why to go, and where to spend the money. It is not it's fine. Students are also wondering where to send my kids. It's where the significance of the education is very, very important. That these mushrooming universities, these newly up universities, are stick in research or not. While traveling within India the past six months, I saw even in villages, it's about saying so and so university. And it's a very small building over there. Or a DMG person. How do you compare that? It's fragile. Because of this mushrooming, still a question mark in the hearts of many, many students as well as parents. Also, the last 15 to 20 years, the ranking system has stopped. Mm -hmm. It's ranks so and so the national landscape or the global landscape. So perhaps that's the best university. And that is really a big question mark in my mind. 
as much as an administrator, I had to work towards making sure that my university ranked high. But I know the inside story too. Obviously, I know the inside story that how these ranking numbers personal, how the outside of the media and not of this rankings. I call it a rankings. That we want to become at the top 50 or top 30 or whatever it is. Yes, must say. Top 20 universities in India are really, 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 really good. No question mark. No question mark. But after that, it's an open. It's an open game. And a lot of effort goes into it. So I actually acknowledge that phrase. It's important because when you go to government or when you go to the industry or when you go to the government, if something convinced them that we are and why are we coming to you? And we have to go and say, uh, Sir, we are the top 100 universities in India. And that's the reason we invite us to judge the skill In my personal opinion, it's not the ranking that is important, but instead, it's the standing of my university that has got huge value. In standing of university does not come overnight. It is a process, it's a culture that is established within an institution. Earth have pursued their heart and soul to education. And the students, they learn that best. They go out, they shine, because the skills. And it's not just they talk about or the definitions of certain things, but they do understand the definition of the principles they study in different books or in different classes or in different practicals that they have. That's the kind of things. Oxford University, Harvard University, Princeton University, Caltech. Put these universities and become extraordinary in the world either. So it's a process, it's an evolution that will happen. But if each of the universities that have caused something spectacular in the backbone of nation is research. It's research. Without research, some things don't happen. Knowledge is difficult to talk about. Just the books and exams and the degree that's never enough. In today's environment, if you go out students and have an interview for any of the company, any of the jobs, you open your mouth. You say your first sentence. The person who's recruiting you knows when you said it. It's when you stand. So even though we want to try our best, and people who are recruiters know that if somebody's coming from this institution, I'm sort of going to be I'll give you an example that when I was living in, in the UAE, I had a I always was coming from a very new start. I don't understand. I knew it. This was after experiencing five or six students from that place who were working in some of the government offices. I was writing with them for Oh, I'm from the US. 
one person, second person, third person, fourth person, fifth person, AUS, displays, uses, and reviews and quality. They don't let the students go out to the same normal day to day and still talk. Those are simple fundamentals which some of the institutions work. And so when research is there, the given answers which for the real life, just for the bookish knowledge. Anyway, when it comes to universities, you and I something unique, when you are doing something innovative, when you are teaching the students something for society. That's all what it matters. These are simple things. Even simple things, teaching, asking the students to get up and talk. Simple. Critical thinking, and they say, soft skills, those are important. So, as much as the both and the most knowledge that is important. I should say, study the factors important, <coughs> other skills around jobs, very, very important. That is one of the difference was between the US and other universities in India. So something I always mention, hopefully this was not my university, but I came and I was going to say that that's a good place. So it's very important to still to education. For your institution. So, distinguish yourself for the crowd by having some skills to your students. Some skills faculty members are able to give the students and make sure that each one of them does that. I was just going to the bed and came out these two pictures, and it was really attractive. I did all the, I must say, I will take this data with a pinch of salt because you know, today there are 50 different agencies that are doing this data analysis and are coming up with their own version of the entity. The institutions on the left side. See two hundred from universities institution. And the and has a potential for improvement and members can make a difference. And being a researcher, I felt research is one of the ways our kids can change course to becoming a host without the future. that you are the best institution, private institution in the league. That happiness is on one side. But the challenge and demand is on the other side because we cannot keep on comparing ourselves only the people around us. We have to start comparing ourselves to the rest of the nation. This is very important. And we start having your bar and you start progressing. Because when you push your boundaries, Hey. 
noi metterci la spada in mano, la spada di un'estate, non può essere. So, in my opinion, there are four kinds of universities. One is that we simply drank degrees. And when I found out that my sons are talking about, I was just telling you, what's the a university that grants degrees versus an institution that is a college for a community college? Then there is an institution where this is research oriented, where the issue of getting degree could have a research while the discipline. And then this transition is research emphasis that we are expect. That's a requirement. Everybody has to do research, but at least a subset of the language in university research to change the profile of the institution. And then the doctor and universities that are research extensive. I think so it's an opportunity for the mushrooming universities in the country to transition space. Now that's up to them to realize that they stand today. And then what is done so that the really want who the really aspired to the Bachelor of so Bachelor of Science degrees can engage in their job. They're not enough. I think is needed. And that's where you need to understand where we go from there. And what makes university stand out? You know, I, I showed you a couple of pictures, but I say that you stand out. How do you do that? Firstly, I'm going to the programs matter a lot. It's quite popular. It's the book. It's up among the top ones. Even at Oxford, the game is not all. Are the best in the world. But some programs are come on the top. So it's the quality of the programs that matters a lot. And an institution that is the best in the world should make sure that our reverse the best students that are coming out of it better than other institutions that are all in the same thing. So that distinction has to be there. Needless to say, the quality of teachers or professors who deliver those programs also has to be higher. And I'm not undermining by saying that a research oriented teacher is the best teacher, but it must change the way the delivery of lectures. Because imagine a teacher that has learned the way ten books, knows everything inside out about a certain subject. He knows about but the horizon to research. Doesn't add up. So the quality of teachers becomes very, very important, and being research oriented is extremely important. Talk about research. Of course, I start off with infrastructure resources that are necessary for that. They should be at least in the point that the machine is oil and run. Some research is going on, and that makes a big difference. And the overall ecosystem. <coughs> the system. How can we think that's not very That makes a big difference. But as I said, while talking about these things, Research is the basis, and it is a very important measure. And you go to any kind of banking, whether I like it or not, or not, it's not a matter. But you must be able to stand out, start doing research. People get trapped. 
whether they are students, whether they are faculty members, whether it is industry, whether it is any organization. A university gets value just because it starts itself or is conducted. And when we talk about research, it's always a confusion that should be wasted in sciences or should be wasted in sciences. Should we at all do research in humanities and social sciences? I remember when I was at Dakota University, there was no agriculture, there was no better university. <laughs> Law, business, education, science, humanities, and Sharia and Islamic studies. So the college is human medicine. So I'm interested in logic those colleges. And sciences. Basis of our existence. Strong belief that it is. So now, the recently the explain, but research has to be done at an institutional level. The institution embraces, the university embraces that we will be engaged in research. It has to be done at the right level, and that's where the programs become very, very important. And has also been to be done at the undergraduate level. Keep the small projects to which the students are exposed, but at the end of their graduation, they are exposed to the village. We do some research and prepare a summary thesis about it. And even if we keep the three to four years of graduation, they are done. Research. Why? Because the research is the of the students. They are forced to think outside the box. They are forced to think outside what is in the curriculum. They are forced to think outside what is important for exams. That's what it is about. When you go on and take up a job, especially the students, Keep in mind that only 10% of what you have learned books will be of direct value when you have that first book. Everything else will be great after that. It will be different to what you have achieved. That's for transition. And when you are doing the research, that's when you start thinking about things that have become very really important in our academic missions. So as much as you should be talking to your teachers about what you are being taught, always learn things beyond So the transition of the institution from whatever it is called research and emphasis or the research for the entry or the research institution, research across the Exist. How do we end the game? How do we get started? How do we make it a part of an institution? Certainly, there are credits to go a lot of planning. How should we do it? And strategic planning is something that I have done the last 14 or 15 years on a regular basis, on an annual basis, depending on strategic plans for different colleges to do research. As well as for the entire university, children should cooperate and how should be invested. So it, it helps their innovation. So where do we stand? On the country or rest of the region or rest of the world. And those, those are the things that have to be kept in mind. 
Eu tenho que ter uma consciência sobre a bomba da X, o sertão, o DMS, o DMS. É a decisão, a decisão de modificar uma parte da consciência de hoje. Mas algo bem no mês. É de tanta hora de cheiro de desinformation é o cara de uma noite. Because one thing I want to this transition and which I'm not sure to experience during my stay on the United States, but as a Bible from the back of the universe, we can go to implement the soldiers on the ground. And it is very important to have their acceptance, to motivate them, to inspire them. Transition. <coughs> transition is important in all of So there has to be a dog, there has to be a pilot, there has to be a pilot. That is current. Whichever college is made, and I think the list of colleges for medicine is not medical sciences or applied sciences are very different from sound art. So we put those colleges over here. Transition. Same time. So some kind of authority has to be put to be known for certain disciplines. That we will invest, and I'm just giving an example, that we will invest in paramedical sciences for a by the law. Because this is same. So those prioritizations should happen in the individual colleges. What is that prioritization? Then this is presented, and the needs are identified for each of those prioritizations. So, topics have to be identified to the list that are important to the college, to the institution. And then, to the future growth of the institution, as well as how to serve the community going to form. So, regional dynamics are very important to the place. Regional needs become very, very important. At the same time, nationwide and globally for humanity are also very, very important. So those things have to be done very the end. In addition, I'm a very strong proponent that disciplines do not have to be isolated. Going on those days when one discipline grows vertically all by itself. Today, medicine and engineering they grow together. Engineering and agriculture and humanities grow together. And you will ask, what is engineering with humanities? Social science is very important. It's an integral part of it. So interdisciplinary, especially research is brought into an institution more and more than more. The second part of the mission is it's extremely important. Now, when it comes to ecosystem development for research, now, if research will stand in all areas, naturally, some kind of infrastructure and resources and lands are needed. No institution will be able to invest at the same time. And that's why they talk about this. So there are second set of four or five areas that we have to find. Those areas where investment needs to be put into big areas. And one of the things that I have a very strong proponent of is that of excellence is that in those areas. For example, I came to know that. Uh, forensic sciences is one of the areas which should uh, have already started or proposed to start. Have already started. 
Now, this is the very unique strength of this institution. I should say that. Institutions in India have more than sciences, or is there the matter? Facilities to be able to, 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 to lead in those directions. So, students lead in that area, for example, just give it as an example. So, it's established. Sports in those areas, or students who will be going in those areas to attract government attention also for a lot of future students. So establishing the pattern that does not say but certain variants of locations to be established and there are certain infrastructure that can be done. But those are the two services that are being really put forward. So if four or five total labs are established that have put that they that can be used, that would be very good. So infrastructure and resources are established accordingly. Of course, an upgraded faculty who can take care of that research is equally important. Now I faced a lot of challenges when I was doing this transition over here. There is a sense of insecurity certainly among the faculty members. That this transition means we will lose our jobs. This is not how it works. There are some faculty members who are desperate to be taken up to the role of teaching. And there are some faculty members who are needed to do research as well as teaching. And then there are some faculty members who are needed to do research intensively. So that relation helps a lot. Additional need of this needed, this transition needs to happen. And it's to say that inspired students of the fruit caliber is very, very important. We always face a challenge in various institutions around the world that students come in and they have a certain level of understanding. But I always have a belief, I have a belief that each of them inspired very significant amount of effort. And they can rise to the occasion and do things that are extraordinary. So I, I believe that students can be inspired by students. Funds are vital. are very, very vital. Of a research institution. It's not just once from within the institution that should the research, but it is the extra little funds that are extremely important. And I was so happy to hear from the process that the institution has got grants from the Dubna, the DBT. And other national agencies. It's an outstanding effort to and focus to do, especially the faculty members and the administrators who are helping others to do. It's really noteworthy. Praises to the number that has been put in. That's an outstanding thing. That's a movement in the right direction. But these funds, once they start coming in, serve as the region with other faculties to participate and, and uh, apply these funds. And then, of course, the think tank, I'm sure, there's a group of faculty members who integrate each other uh, to go in the direction. And also, the administrators over here are it's a very conducive environment that uh, the think tank is in the seat for the transition that few people are already experiencing predictable funding as well as the Whenever the research is conducted, it's in house. Everything is not a And that's where 
collaboration is becomes very important. I've done projects for my life. Some problems in funding that I received in different countries around the world, whether it was European Union, whether it was Danish Council for research, whether it was the Swedish Council for research, whether it was NIH, United States, whether it was USDA. <laughs> Singularly, I could do only this much, but with collaborators, this much. That's where collaboration is very, very important. When I talk about collaboration, it's not just academic, academic institution, because then it's a narrow window of the question has to be the best, the best thing has to be involved, they have to be attracted. Because at the end of the day, we wonder who are eventually going to use whatever we will do. So it is the industry. Society will use it. They are the best. So institutes and organizations, if not together for collaboration, that can be serves an opportunity for growth research in an institution. Coming towards the end then, the most important promotion of institution towards research is a strong brand. I cannot emphasize enough how significant global place the next level and the next level. Around once we said a tier one of universities, masters and programs, and any postdocs, and I'm sure the quality of a master's program perhaps perhaps have started or about to start have started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So this is a fabulous thing, but then it's taken from the right direction because. Starts when there are PhD students, when there are master's students, are they motivated to come up with something novel and impactful and also publications? But there's a lack of institution that then responds. So, graduate programs are critical. Whenever the research structure is established, Students were having their first activity. Finally, all these those labs watching. What's going on with this lab? What this type of work is going on? Walk into this and talk to the professor, see what is going on. Then suddenly, can I volunteer in the lab and or volunteer on this project? So, Get exposed sooner or later to the growing university research. Whatever they are doing, but the institution benefits to the school. And the students will be those who will come to the master's of teaching. To get jobs outside from become my bastards of this place. But the only research that happens over here is simply outstanding. I learned so much because of that. Happened. So, our student research is also equally important because that segues it for the institution to become even more stronger. So, research, center of excellence, some programs, this work was transitioning into a research process or a research intensive process. And this is another profile of an institution changes. When I started at New York University, 
the biggest challenge that I faced was the amount of some funding which the institution was getting. And I was telling Vice Chancellor that for discuss it with students, and by the time I left, the amount of the funding was extremely. That I was able to do it for an institution that was only taking care of the institution. Today, that institution is a research purpose. That's the transition that happens. If it can happen in six years over there, I'm sure it can happen in the future. It's just combined. It's not just the administrators. It's not just the fact that the workers. It's also the participation of students and their hunger and their desire. That I can get a better job if I inform the research. So research students to a different level of ability. And that's the fact that the members to keep on for reaching out to the So, with these words, I finish and put a word for your kind patients. I will add it to the eyes and make it and I will make it to the for the students. I don't want you to be fine. Thank you. I only discuss with the models. Students, this is the program to bring the data to the visual aspect of a university group. Oh, sir, I just, I'll just of all the wonderful presentation that uh, you have visualized us and how we see how uh, this tradition, uh, how this small culture is important to uh, keep the culture. So, sir, I have a small one. Uh, uh, as you already know, that we are reaching uh, culture. That you can reach the culture and or uh, in Chile, in particular, in the era. So, how important, how much relevant that in Chile, maybe the traditional religion has started to be? Why? In Chile, religion is not the traditional practices of the real good uh, or the current use. Uh, this is the first question. And the second one is that, sir. Uh, <laughs> Uh, is it possible uh, to do the good research in a limited resource? So, I think it's not knowledge. Yeah. It's coming from the I heard it's frozen. <laughs> uh, sorry, what was it? So, traditional knowledge. So, traditional knowledge also. Knowledge level through authentication that can be used. Uh, traditional knowledge is important because it still serves as the basis, it still serves as the foundation. But always keep in mind, it's not comprehensive, it's not perfect. There's always more of what is. Now, can I give you one You don't say I love it. Sorry, you have a whole So there has to be a hunger. Do the traditional knowledge. It's is for 
If you have not finished, if you have not grown, Just your thought process has not, this is is not being kicked in. And what should be kicked in because I'm just not thinking that prior to the creation of knowledge and its application in the field of whatever it is, is so and so. How can I make a difference out of that? For example, of Elon Musk. No, Elon Musk? Yes. People started thinking him crazy when he started talking, talking about the cars, electric cars. Started thinking that he's crazy when he started talking about whatever his cars. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Seems to good. There's a lot of electronics in it. There's no mechanics improvement in it. So we should be happy. But we ought to see beyond the horizon. And he said, I will do it. So you can keep on knocking at you, but I will do it. That's what it is about. He had an additional knowledge. But he wanted. Of a certain amount. Right? He didn't start a space explorer. Space, space explorer is a good deal of that. It's a chance. Take a look at a program on Netflix that talks about the other master. How does this job work? in you from this knowledge. So that's the, I hope it answers the first part. Sir, uh, another thing was to do good research in the need research. In the same document, certainly the same documentary, so he decided it was how can I create problems that caused some in 10 years, it took 10 years. You can only sit back and say that you know what? I don't know. Therefore, I don't research. I, I shared my own experience. Uh, when I finished my degree, started uh, teaching as an assistant professor. And my boss called me and said that you're going to start working on chromosomes and do things. Talking about I'm thinking. And our cell cultures need that doesn't. I wish the cells can get triggered so that they grow. So, now that is what hoping. The trigger is needed, and the chemical is needed to make them grow. Now grow from where to make it. Somehow I found the stigma. That in Delhi is a supplier. This is talking about 1980, okay? And there is a supplier who can kill. I reached out to him. In one month, I came to know that it costs this month. My professor said, Forget it. I will not give you this money. Now, I don't want to stop doing that. Sir, I asked for money. I found out it costs this much. You said, There's no money. That's the story. Started looking into the literature. Came from the skin means karma. Okay? The kidneys are the source of this problem, right? And 
subscriptions. The treasure. There was no internet that that, okay? There was no internet that So from that, there was no Mr. Google that was there that So from that day, I think of the internet and the internet found out that this is how whole book my reference is there. Trust me. The next four days, it's a bad one. So I watched like crazy, and I grew them, prepared them, they stretch and put over the part of them in the sense of it. So you can always say that this cannot be done. You can have a thousand reasons for continuation. But you should have 10,000 reasons. It's always possible. So that's an extreme example. But in a realistic world, you might aspire this way, you might not achieve it because of funding constraints. Try to make that project small, which is feasible. In today's environment, it is possible to fund those smaller projects. And once you get preliminary data for a certain project, is always possible to get more funding after that. Okay? And the So, since we are talking about the research, for the research, we have a very important share by the research and we have a very different problem that the day is to publish research paper and then present usable. How do we have a research for the society, but to an area? Now all the research papers paper is limited to a particular community of the research and community, this is community or the strip of it. It's uh, aligned by research outcome with the social the society where we have done that return and we have published the research for their data. So here, uh, I, so I want to ask you one uh, that can you suggest it part? To means uh, reduce the gap in the where we have done the research and how the research outcome particular Okay. Uh, so let's start here. Starting. We have to make this transparent and this simply. And this is how things will be done. I think so. There are two strong words over here. Who have been in the major review committees who will be able to also guide you that when such plans prepared, the dissemination plan is always in place. But this is how the publication was prepared, this is how the society will benefit, this is how the students benefit, or which of a community that is contributing to the major plan. So when things are clear, usually chances of fusion is not there or good. Because it's all planned right from the beginning, from day one. Secondly, emphasizing collaboration on the first. Due credit is given to all 